I'm Kristen. And I'm Emily. And today we're going to show you how to do a hot reaction versus a cold reaction and then compare the rate of reaction. Yay, catalysts! What kind of catalysts? Catalase, which is commonly found in the liver. All right, so. And a couple other things, but mostly in the liver. So, what's Emily doing? Emily is going to get the cold hydrogen peroxide and the cold liver out of the ice bath while we wait for the warm liver and hydrogen peroxide to finish setting for the three minutes it's required. So you have what's in those two test tubes right there? We have liver in this one and hydrogen peroxide in this one. So you're warming them both up. Yes. And then Emily, what have you brought back for us? I have the ice bath liver and hydrogen peroxide. So we basically cooled both and we cooled both so we're going to combine them together at the same time so that we can compare. Okay, wait, wait. Okay, get ready? Uh, go. Basically, what the hot reaction is doing, what Kristen has, is it's using up the hydrogen peroxide faster, which shows that the bubbles are going higher faster. And basically what Emily's is doing is, even though it's going at a slower rate, it's still consuming the hydrogen, hydrogen peroxide, but it is doing it at a slower rate. And the bubbles, see how they aren't as high? It shows that it's not going. Wow, I think I understand everything I need to know about enzymes. So that's the difference between a hot and warm catalyst reaction. Cold. Or cold and hot. Hot and cold. Yes.